What is up guys, Elite2RX here, back with another video, and as you see, I didn't quite do my homework, it's because I've been so busy, and I couldn't complete my homework, but by next episode I should complete it, but you guys have to complete it though. <laughs> Alright, in today's video I'll be teaching you guys how to like build, like, you know, because we're going to finish the rings for the next two episodes, and then work on the interior. Hope you guys are excited about that. And yeah, so, according to YouTube Analytics, only 14.7% of people are actually subscribed. If you do enjoy my content, please subscribe. It helps the channel out a lot. It makes, like, it inspires me to do more. Because I want to try and hit 1,000 by the end of the year. So without further ado, let's get on. Do not mind this, guys. Do not yell at me in the comments. I will do my homework. <laughs> I've just been so busy. But let's get in with the tutorial. Right, guys, what you are going to need is quartz stairs. And what you want to do is go all around the ring and just place the quartz stairs all around. Now, I know I haven't finished the ring, so I cannot complete this now. But I'm going to do that off camera. But you guys have to do it on all the sides of the ring. I'm just going to do this side. Like... Let's just do this. Just bring it around like this. It's pretty easy. Not too hard. And you also want to do the same exact thing on the inside of the ring. So like this. Oops. You just want to bring it all around. I'm just going to show you how to do this. And yep, on these sides, you also want to do it on like... So just do it all around like this, so pretty easy. You want to bring it across like here and just connect all of it. And it should look like this. And then what you want to do is get your quartz blocks. Uh, not smooth quartz blocks, actually. Just regular quartz blocks. And you want to put it on the stairs and you want to go one block down. So you know how we did it at first with the, like when we were doing the pyramid. That's how we do it. That's how we're going to do it. Like, move out the way, fish. And just bring it across like this. And then under, you want to go like this. So upside down stairs under. So it's kind of similar to the one we did, like, when we were building the um, pyramid. So, yep, it should look like this. And you have to do it the same thing all around. Do just place blocks under here, quartz blocks, whatever block you're using to build this base and just repeat the cycle. So once you've done that, it should look like, all right guys, it should look like this all around. Well, I haven't completed the bottom layer, but I did on some of these sides. Sorry about that, but if I want to get this video out earlier, then I have had to like not do it, but it should look like this on both sides and yours should all be completed because, yep. So. What you want to do is go to any side you prefer. I'm probably going to go to this side. I have my friend helping me over here, by the way. Oops, I forgot to. Wait, no, I didn't. Okay. So I have to bring this across. Silly me. All right, let me just bring this across. All right. Now what you want to do is you want to get any block of your oops, not that any block of your choosing. I'm going to use quartz, but you could use any blocks because you're going to get rid of this once you've completed it. But just bring it all across until the last stair, so it should look like this. And then you want to place bottom stairs like this, so it should look like this. And you want to just bring it all around like this. I hate kelp, and I keep saying this again. So just oops. Upside down stairs. My enemies are stairs. You remember from the first episode? That was painful. And then you want to do get your block again and just go another row like this. And you basically only have to go down two. So, <clears throat> so this is the last row you'll need to do. I'm going to do this all with you, but I'm going to let you do the clearing all by yourself. Get rid of this stupid kelp. All right, just bring it around like this. Just, guys, I promise I'll do my homework by the end. Uh, by next video, have faith in me, guys. But just bring it down like this, and boom, it should look like this so far. Now you want to go on this side now and get 
your block, whatever block you're using, and just bring it across like this. So it's pretty easy and simple, not that hard if you ask me. And then you just want to bring it across like this. <clears throat> so you just gotta do this. Oops. I see my friend's Nick Gamer tag. He's helping me because this is gonna take a long time. Then you want to go another row. I suggest you guys use like cobblestone or dirt because you're gonna have to get rid of it sooner or later. Oops, I went out too far. No. And then you want to do this last layer. Alright, let's just... And by the way, guys, we are almost done with the series. I suggest there's like five more episodes or... Yeah, five more or so episodes. Then we're finished with the series. I'm excited. I don't know about you guys. But now you want to take away these blocks. So you could just take them away now. But I can't wait to finish the series and move on to something else. All right, guys, I'm not gonna do that on camera, but what you wanna do is go one block down. So it should look like this. And you just wanna, boom, just bring it like this. Bring it all across. pretty easy. Just bring it like this. I really like this, how Impulse did it, because we're gonna need it for the final step of this tutorial. Now this tutorial may be short, but this actually took way more time than all the other ones. Like this took longer than all of the other videos. But yet the video is so short. And then you just want to make the wall here. So just make a wall. And then you want to make a wall over here too. So you can make your wall here. Probably going to need a lot of underwater breathing. And you need a door. You could use any door. It doesn't really matter. So then place a door here. And now, you want to clear all of this, but you could get rid of these blocks here. I'm just going to get rid of them. But your job is to do this all around, so I'm going to let you guys do that all around. It's pretty easy, guys. Don't worry about it. But, yep. You, I want you guys to clear it, too. So, once you've done that, the inside should look like... Should look like this, once you've cleared the insides. Looks pretty fancy in here. But now... You're gonna have to do that all around and clear it all out. So, I'm gonna let you guys do that. Once you've done that on each side, I want you to do this on each side. We will get into the final step. So, let's go. So a friend of mine's have, has uh, spawned a lot of kitties. Be a dog. <laughs> oh! What's the name? What is it? No! No, 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 all right, next, next, next thing you guys are going to need is, uh, <clears throat> you're going to need cyan stained glass panes, you're going to need blocks, of course, you need a beacon, and you're going to need a oak trap door. <laughs> all right, so what you want to do is you want to go nine, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and on this block, you want to go down, and then you want to place your block here, and you want to place a quartz, um, What's it? Not a quartz. It's a uh, it's a torch. So you want to play right here. Oops! Activate. Oops! Wrong direction. That's why. So you want to turn it this direction. No, not this. What? Why? Oh wait. So you want to do this. Put stairs like this. Put a stair right here. And a stair right here. Oops. And a stair right here. And you want to place a trap door like that. And then, wait, should it? Oops. Uh, so, impulse did it like this. 
and you want to place a beacon on top like this. Now I know he didn't do it like this, but bedrock mechanics are like horrible, so it's not letting me do it as you do it. So six, seven, eight, to nine. One, two, and then one back here. I'm gonna do this one row with you guys, just so it makes sense. And put it like this. Oh no, he left. <laughs> I think he disconnected. Oh wait, no, I did the stairs wrong. So like this, and like this, all right. So it's every nine blocks, so another nine. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Like this, like this, like this. And then you wanna place a iron trap door like this. Bring it up like that. And you wanna put the best part on it. The beacon. Now, I don't know, like, I'm gonna let you guys, I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm gonna set it up to like it actually is. But I'm gonna let you guys like turn on the beacon and you know. So another nine blocks. I'm gonna let you guys do these on all the sides by yourself once I've done this. Cause it's like the easiest thing ever. So like this. And it should look like this. Well, it's looking pretty similar. So one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Like this, like this, and like this. Boom, bam, bop. It's the easiest thing ever. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then, yep, yeah, so I want you, so it, you should have four like this. So it should look like this from up top. And it should look like this from the sides. Now, I want you to do it on these sides, and I want you to do it on all the sides. And yep. So, you do that, and I will show you what it looks like once you've completed it. Alright, guys. It should look like this once you've done it. Do all the sides, but I'm going to end the video off here. So, just do all the sides, but I only did two. So, all of this should be filled, and I have some homework to do. So much homework to do. So, in this video, we did a lot. We did a lot, guys. And I am so stressed and I'm so burnt out. Because this took so long, guys. This took so... Die. But this took so long. And I'm probably going to take, like, a two-week break off from this, this tutorial. So, probably not... I'm not going to upload this next week, but I am probably going to upload it the week after that so guys if you did enjoy this video please like and subscribe this took forever for me and my friends and yep we are i am burnt out right now but i'm going to provide you guys with another one in like two weeks or three weeks i don't know but if you guys did enjoy please subscribe and like like i just said the base is starting to look good and one more thing what I'd do is I'd add sea lanterns every seven blocks. No, actually every four blocks. So that's not how he has it, but I am not sure how he has it. But you don't need the sea lanterns to be completely like his, guys. Come on. <laughs> but I'm just going to do this. You could put the sea lanterns like whatever you want, whatever block amount you want. That is your decision. But I'm doing every four blocks, every five blocks, actually. So I'm just going to do this. I'm just going to put one right here. All right. It should look like this. Or how long, however much as you do it. So next video, we will be completing the ring. Adding those little buildings on each side of the ring. And yeah, love you guys to death. And I'll see you in the next video.